Welcome back to Timmy in Chandelier. This is chapter three. Yeah, so I'm, uh, I'm gonna continue. I've got a blue and black deck, as you may recall. If you missed some episodes, um, there's an info card popping up right now, probably with the link to the playlist, so you can just uh, check that out if you wanna see my campaign from the start. But let's see, what do I have to do? I gotta defeat a conjurer, any witch is attacking the unicorn sanctum. Pretty far away. Okay, so first let's defeat a conjurer. Hey, trade blue amulets for any lands. Okay. Let's do that first. Underground sea, I need a uh, three. Dang it. If it's any land, so I could do a factory, I guess. Strip mine, kind of mean. City of brass. Hmm. City of Brass would be good. I think I'm gonna go for City. I think I need mana consistency here. Pretty boring, but it's important that you can cast your spells, right? Um, okay, so I'm gonna defeat a Conjurer, okay. That's not a Conjurer, I think. That is not a Conjurer. Going in the swamp, that's a Conjurer, yeah. Oh, I can win a tome. That's pretty good. Let's do it. There we go. It's funny, they usually choose to draw first, which is interesting, right? Because now you always choose to, to play first. In the modern era of magic, let's see, what do I have? No turn one play, so I'm just going to go for swamp and pass. Next turn, I could play a Cephal Falcon. Let's go City of Brass into the Falcon, and then the turn after. I can hopefully play the Unstable and attack for four. Ooh, the Conjurer is discarding, so that's really good. Good news for me. I'm gonna go aggressive here. Attack for four, put the Conjurer on eight. Next turn on five, hopefully. Okay, there's the Tortoise, which is good, but I've got flying. And now I've got four mana to cast that uh, Phantom Monster. Passing the turn. Okay, so next turn I can actually win it already. This is a super quick game. Hey! Oh, look at that. Another counter spell. Sweet. Four spike. Take the cards. I got a duplicate card. Oh, that's so nice. I can choose anything. Counter spell, maybe control magic. Should go for control magic. Mahamoti is really sweet, like two Mahamotis. And Mahamotis are rare. But I think Control Magic's better, but I mean a Papa Moti. Why is life so difficult? I'm 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 I gotta go for Control Magic. Control Magic's good. Yes. Okay, and I'm gonna go back to the shrine to claim my price. You are rewarded with Uh oh. I think we've got an error, like you cannot see the cards that I'm choosing. Yes, I'll take this card. What is it? That's the thing with this game, I mean it's got its glitches. 
what did I pick? I see no new artifacts in here. Anyway, well, doesn't matter. It matters, but... Okay, I'm gonna play another counter spell. I'm gonna play another control magic. Four spikes, also cool. I'm gonna play four spikes, why not? Now I gotta ditch a couple of cards, or I need some more lands. Let's see how many lands I have. Okay, so I've got another swamp. I've got 20 lands, actually. I'm not too bad. I've got... Okay, I don't have to ditch any cards, I think. I've got 21, so I need to add some more. I can play the unsummon. Let's see what black cards I have. Word of Binding is pretty decent. War of Artifact is good. Let's see if I can buy something. Okay, Blue Elemental Blast. It's Degovian. Can I sell something? Got no red cards, no green cards, okay. Let's see, because I want to free the village. Unicorn Sanctum. You could go there. North to Nevermore Hole. Okay, I think I'm going to go there instead. Nevermore Hole. Somewhere north, so I guess I'm just going to go up north to see if I can get that item. Another planes. What's the quest? Take a black creature spell west to the keeper's Zephyr Hole. I'll give you a mana link. I'm gonna accept it. I think I've got, do I have? I mean, mana link means more life, so it's pretty good. Okay, I can just give the pit scorpion. Whatever. Um, or is there something else I can give? Cyclopean mummy, I think I'm gonna give the mummy. You know what? I'm gonna buy the Marsh Viper just for fun. It's only five gold. I've got the Pit Scorpion and the Marsh Viper, so maybe I can make like a poison deck later on. Uh, west is Zephyr Hole. Where's Zephyr Hole? Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't, 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 don't. Ank of Misha. That's a good card. some food, and go, I'm on my way. Duel the Warlock. I got no money. Scavenging Ghoul, Merc Dwellers. Now I think both of these cards actually got um, changed into zombies, they're creature types, so they're also zombies. Which is quite nice, because Merc Dwellers, it's, it, you can play it in a zombie deck, you know? Two or one. Let's see, what do I have? Not much. I can play Zephyr Falcon turn two, El Hajash turn three. Uh, let's check it out. Okay, so we're gonna cast Zephyr Falcon. Oh, Terror. I want a Terror. That's a card I'm looking for still. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see. I'm eating some oranges for vitamins, by the way. What shall I do? Sinkhole for the tempo player and El Hajaj? I think I'm going to go sinkhole. I'm not expecting any special lands from the opponent here. Okay. Island, El Hajaj. Oh man, hippie. I can steal it. No problem. This is perfect. Steal the hippie. Gain a life. Deal the damage. This is this is a super good turn. Stole the hippie, dealt the damage, gained a life. Ideal. If you're the warlock, you're not happy. Hmm. This is again perfect. Just attack. If he blocks, fine. 
I'm gonna play the Malamoti. Take the damage. The only downside, of course, is, is that you preferably just wanna don't want to play out the Malamoti when you've got the counter spell in hand. Rather go up maybe to eight mana, play the um, the Malamoti later. But I think in this in the Chandelar realm, it's it's safe. There we go. That Merc Dwellers can hit for four, huh? It's got this really cool bonus. So that's why it's quite nice in uh, in the zombie decks with Zombie Master, give it Swamp Walk, Evil Presence, and then just deal four a turn. It's quite nice. Let's see, I still have the counter spell though. I'm, I'm fine with the Scorpion. I don't mind. Shall I offer the trade? No, I'm not going to offer the trade. I think I'm going to chump next turn. I think I'm going to chump the Merc Dwellers. Because, I mean, if he has Howl from Beyond or something, I'm toast. So I'm on nine. He's on two. There is a Frozen Shade. Okay. Probably should have counterspelled the Frozen Shade, by the way. That was bad magic from my part. Hey, still winning though. Underground C, absolutely taking the cards. What, what, what did I give? Because they said, we're pleased. I wonder what did I give? What did they take? Oh, they took... No, they didn't take a card. Okay. I thought maybe I have to give a card away to say take a creature, black creature spell, but maybe they gave it to me or something. I don't know. Um, but first things first, I got to add an underground C. Uh, 51 cards. Let's go to black. Dark Rich was a nice inclusion, I guess. I think Siphon Soul is good. It's kind of like direct damage in blue. It's useful. Um, Psygovian Leviathan? I mean, why not? Buy cards. Soul Net. Wooden Sphere. Maybe a Soul Net. Oh, I don't have the money. I only got 60. I gotta sell stuff. I'm bad at selling stuff. It's funny, like in real life, I don't like to sell magic cards. And also in this game, I don't like to sell magic cards. The thing is, I always see some kind of use for the cards. I'm like, I can still use it that way or this way. Talking about using it, I can play my Merc Dwellers because it works really well with the Thomas's Wand. Mmm. I mean, I got a lot of mediocre cards in my deck, but I still don't want to sell them. I could sell Sacrifice 150. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Um, okay. Was I going? I was going up north, right? Let's see. What's this? Mm, journal. Done. What's Wiz stats? Did you see that? Oh, that's how they how far they are. You can see the creatures. Oh yeah, I think the there's something with the staff, right? If it's completely red or something, they've won or there's something with that. Or you've defeated them, I don't know. Okay, so I've got to go north to Hornwall Hole. North. Evil Presence, that's a good card. Drain Light, that's a good card. I've got no more money, that's a problem. 
Take this message west to my brother, the keeper of Amethyst Temple. He rewards you with a black amulet. Okay, sure. West. And we're gonna sell because I need some food as well. I think I'm gonna sell my Avon Morse. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, west. Um, but here first I saw this gravesite. Let's see if I can find something. A swamp. Sweet. Bum, 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 bum. Hey, more treasure. Plain sure. Vampire bats. Yes, please. Don't have the money though. Winter orb. That, that's a nasty card. Don't have the money. Let's see, gotta go west. Where am I? Pretty close. There we go. Hey, I got a gem. Ooh, trade black amulets for any cards. Um, Timmy? But I actually got to think about this. I've got four black amulets. I could maybe get a Vesuvian. Yeah. I'm going to get myself a Vesuvian. Can I, can I get any blue card? Any? Accessor Recall? Psionic Blast is a really good one. Counter Spell, of course. Then I'm gonna get a two tins, I think. This one. Pirate ship school. I think I'm just gonna do this. Let's see, a Timmy. How many Tims do I have? Yes, yeah, so I'm just gonna play two more Tims. Play another counter spell. That's good. Stasis. Do I want to sell a stasis? Sacrifice is 80. I'll sell a second. Ooh, reward me with blue cards? Yes, please. Okay, knight, here I come. No! Phantom monster. Mm. I'll, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. Okay. Vampire Lord. I'm much better. Hey, Vampire Lord. Look at this. Underground Sea. Rest of my hands really bad. Dark Ritual, Cursed Land, and Lance. That's it. Vampire Bats. I wanted a Vampire Bats turn one. Mmm, look at that. Timmy. I think I'm gonna ritual out of Tim. I think it's a good thing to do. And now I'm gonna play to Tim. And I'm gonna take a mana burn. Oh no! But it's good, because I can kill the bats. I mean, turn one. No! No, 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 no. Okay. This is really bad. This is really bad. Of course. This is actually pretty nice. Because look. Give me back my Tim. Ah, ah. Give me back my Tim. Oh, I love this game. It's so funny, all these situations. I, I think Unsummon actually is really a good card. But um, yeah, it hardly sees any play anymore. In the current old school meta, I play two of my sideboards against um, hippies. Oh, not again a weakness. 
He's doing exactly the same thing. That is not cool. That is not cool. I only have one unsummon in the deck, so... I guess I'm playing with too many lands now, by the way. I don't want to play El Josh because he's got the Timmy. He can kill the uh, El Josh. Sure, you go and attack. Hmm. Oh man, saying you're vampire. I mean, it makes sense. You're the vampire lord, but still. Oh, this is so bad. I think the only card that kind of could have saved me here was uh, Control Magic. So I'm playing out the El Hajash here just to take a hit from the from the Tim so I don't have to take the damage directly, but I think I'm still going to die, though. Phantom Monster, that's a good card. Howling Mine, okay. Duel the Seer. Go for it. Start the duel. Okay, I can play Merfolk of the Pearl, Trident, and a Vampire Bats. Okay, so I'm going to go for Vampire Bats. Unfortunately, I don't have double blue in hand because I've got a counter spell, so then... That would have been even better, but still. It's a decent hand. Go for the swamp. Um, I guess I gotta attack first. Let's see what he does. Or she does, I should say. Fast effects, not yet, okay. Now I'm gonna assign fast effects. So this is gonna cost me a turn, you know, but at least I got the Ornithopter out of the way and I think she's playing with like Unstable, so she's gonna do Ornithopter, Unstable, Unstable, and then play with like Time Elemental and stuff. It's a pretty cool deck. Okay, so we got a second one. Um, I'm just gonna play Merfolk. Just gonna attack here. I'm just going to pump. Another option would have been to just, you know, attack for one, keep counter magic open, but where's the fun in that, right? We'll, that counter spell will be used later. Maybe I'll regret it. We'll see. But, I mean, she's on six. I can kind of push through. Do another island. Hmm... Right now, I'm going to attack. I, th I, I'm a, I can actually kill her already. Wow. If she has no tricks, I'm winning it. Oh, she's got a trick, though. Unsummon. That is a good one. Unsummon on an unstable card. That's really good. Hmm. Very clever. Very clever. On four, though. So close. This is good because Segovian Leviathan has um, Island Walk. So I think what I'm going to do is attack with both. And this one is how much mana? Five mana. Okay, so I need all my mana. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to pump the Vampire Bats. Because I want to play... Oh, no! Counter magic. <sighs> no, unstable. She's doing a really good job in staying alive. I have to compliment her on that. That's a really good job. Now she's attacking me, so I'm dropping in life totals. Oh, man. Um, What is wisdom here? I'm going to play out the Merc. Dwellers. 
I still think I'm gonna win this. I mean, I also have that word of binding next turn. Pump it up. Do two points, exactly. So she's on two. And summon again. Like, she's got tricks, right? But... And now I've got counter magic. Okay, I'm winning it. Okay. Another unsale mutation. That's good. Take the cards. Oh, yeah. I need to defeat an undead knight. I forgot. Hey, there's an undead knight. Bring it on. Remember, if I win this, I can choose any blue card. So I'm just going to go for Fasubi. If I win. If I win. Got to win first. Please let me win. Play first. Bring on the goodies. Um, start the duel. So I got a swamp and a swamp, which is bad. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I was a bit too optimistic after winning the last couple of games. Oh, this is bad. I need blue mana next turn. Then at least I can play the Tim. Oh, look at my hand. It's so good, but I got no blue mana. Oh, no. Oh, no. Swinging in. I'm on 10. This is rough. This is rough. Now I got to discard. What, what to discard? Oh, man. I think the Leviathan, because this is black anyway. This is bad. Like, I'm on 10. I'm going to drop to 7. I need a land. I need a land. An island, an island, an island. El Hajash. Okay, City of Brass, that's something's gonna hurt me though, but um what is wisdom? If I go for the Tim, I'm not gonna block, I'm gonna take four, plus I'm gonna take a damage from the city. I could also say I'm gonna do Murfolk Chump. I'll go to five. You know, I'm gonna go for the Tim. I'm gonna go for the Tim and I'm not gonna block with the Tim though. So I'm gonna drop a lot. Hopefully I can find an island and I can steal the dredge skeleton with the control magic next turn. Ooh, that's bad news. I got no trigger effects. What can I do? It, it has summoning sickness. Ooh, I like this. Uh, okay, gonna play this out. For a blue, of course. No, 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 I gotta cancel. I gotta do unsummon. Cancel. Ooh, almost made a mistake there. I'm gonna unsummon the drudge, and then he's gonna lose the unholy strength on it at least. I'm gonna drop to two. Okay, make that one. Okay, make that I'm going to die. <laughs> My vampire bats. Sorry, guys, I haven't defeated the knight yet. It's, it's taking a little bit more work than I thought. It's a really good knight. You could have warned me that it was such a talented knight, by the way. You know what? I'm just going to put the pit scorpion in there as well. I don't care. Or do I have really good blue cards? Wait. Da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, I got unstable mutation. Okay. Okay, how many creatures do I have? One, two, three, four, seven, eight, nine, eleven, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Eighteen is actually not, I mean, it's a lot, but it's not that much. Hmm. Still gonna cut the scorpion though. Oh, a swamp. Do I need that? Drudge is good. Vampire Bats is good. I got no money anymore. 
Um, so I'm going to dump the Cyclopean Mummy. I'm going to put in a Drudge instead. I think that's better. I think that's better. Oh. You may trade your Cormus Bell for five extra life in the next duel. No, never mind. What are you talking about? I don't want to battle the troll. I want to battle the... No, 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 no. Okay, Sedge Beast. Go. Go, Sedge Beast, go. Look at my hand, it's horrible. I feel like now I'm playing without enough lands, right? I mean, this is the second game in a row that I'm low on lands. Oh, man. No to self, I need to check my deck, take some cards out or, you know, add some more lands or something. No, I got a discard. Oh man, word of binding, whatever. <sighs> this is bad. And I'm gonna lose the City of Brass in this match. Yeah, of course, take, take care of my own land. This is a moment where I really just wanna, you know, uh, I just want to say, you know, whatever, quit the game, but I'm not gonna. Um, oh man, curse land. Okay, he's also discarding at least. Card to discard. I think water elemental since I'm so far behind. I mean, in the most ideal scenario, he's not going to play out anything anymore, and I'm just going to draw into lands, lands, lands. Which is not happening. Mm. I'm going to dump a counter spell. Attack for three. Okay, I'm on four. Man, I'm getting my ass kicked. Oh, the Leviathan. Okay, kill me now. I wanted to concede, but I don't. I like this, actually, immolation on, on Urk Raider. That's really cool. Hey, hey, there's the knight. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to try to defeat the knight. This is going to be my last game in this, this episode. Chapter 3. Duel. The Undead Knight. Okay, winning the toss, that's good. So I'm gonna play first. Bring it on, bring it on, bring it on. Okay, I've got enough mana, that's a good start. Um, play an island, and I can now play the force spike, right? If you play something out, that's gonna be cool. Okay, he's not gonna, whatever. Um, I'm gonna play a swamp. Next turn, I can play Wall of Air. If you play something out now, I can probably force spike. Drudge, Bad Moon, or of course, Black Knight. This feels really good. This feels really good. I've got a good feeling about this matchup. Wall of Air. Next turn, Ghost Ship. Drudge, okay, that's no problem. Play a ghost ship. Pass the turn. Sure, go ahead, go for it. It's a 3 2. I don't care. I could even I can't even steal it next turn, which is gonna be nice. Ooh, the lost soul is good. I think I'm gonna steal the lost soul. I think I'm gonna do that. Because the lost soul has swamp walk, so she's unblockable. I'm gonna attack here. I could put an unstable on her next turn, so I've got a 5-4. Okay, fear, fair enough. I like fear, that's cool. 
But I mean, I can deal seven damage next turn, right? I hope. Okay, let's do this. So I'm going to go unstable on the Lost Soul. And she has Swamp Walk, and he's got Swamps. So I'm going to deal seven. Then I'm going to play Cursed Land, and I think he's dead. But I've said that before, and then I still lost. But I think I'm going to win this now. Hey, yes! Winning it! And Contract from Below. That is the best card in Magic when you're playing for Anti. So I'll definitely take the cards. Hey, I'm finding another Magic card. No, 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 I don't want to play against you guys. Duel the Beast. Duel the Beast. I wanted this to be the last match, but, you know. Got to duel the beast. Mm, go for island pass. I do have a dark ritual, so maybe I can get the Mamoti out early. Hmm, I could also go for ritual into Timmy. Shall I do that? Or am I going to count on getting a land next turn? This is me thinking, by the way. Um, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. Just please give me a land next turn. Give me a land. Drop to Tim. It's not happening. In that case, I am going to... Play out... The 10. Gonna take mana burn. Next turn I could cast unstable. Oh, this is really bad. The strip mine is so good. I wonder with how many strip mines you can you can play in this game. If you know, let me know. Can you just play with like three, four strip mines? Do I want to attack now? You know what? I'm gonna. I'm gonna. It's a risk. I mean, if, if he has an unholy strength, I'm gonna take four. Island. Uh, I can attack again, put on seven, I would go to four. You know what? I'm not going to attack because if he doesn't attack with the Urk, he takes two damage. I forgot about that. Like, Urk Raider is a pretty cool card. Ooh. That is mean, man. Casting all those blights on my mana. That is mean. You're a mean troll. At least I got uh, taken care of the Earth Raider. The problem is if I cast something because of those two blights, I'm just going to lose tons of lands. At least I find another land at something. Um, it's not going to work. Water? Shall I just play Water Elemental? Why not? Blue. Trigger effects, yes, they're all gonna go. That's something nice to note, by the way, that with Blight, your land gets destroyed at the end of the turn. So, I mean, you can still like untap it with uh, Candelabra of Tonish, use it as, as often as you want in that turn. Another Blight, by the way, that sucks. My Tim is gonna die. But I'm gonna ping you one last time. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Ping you one last time. Mm, 
I can drain for one only, okay, which is not enough. Hmm. If I attack, I'll put him on one, and then I can drain life for one. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. I mean, this is also not too bad. Like, he loses the 2-2. Two -two. He's not playing out anything. Okay, that's sweet. Go, let's go. He's still going to win this? Drain life. Black mana. Casting drain life for two. Done. Sedge. Hey, winning with the drain life. That's sweet. Another contract from below. That's insane. That's it. I'm going to put all those cards in my deck. And I want an amulet. People are glad you got rid of the pesky knight and they reward you with any card. Or are there any other cards that I'm not thinking about? Of course, it could go for another underground sea. You know what? I'm not going to do that. I'm gonna, I am I was going to go for the double ganger. I'm going to go for the double ganger. I mean, her art is amazing, so I have to go for that one. Yes, I'll take the card. Okay. Let's have a look. What do we have? I think I'm going to sell some cards. Play both the contracts. That's a no-brainer. Uh, and I got to play my Fusuvan. Pursuvan. And I gotta get rid of some cards. So I guess Merfolk of the Pearl Trident has to go. Mm. I think Word of Binding. I'm not really happy with Word of Binding. Evil Presence. I could play Word of Binding again. I guess Spirit Shackles. Actually, Spirit Shackles is pretty good. I'm gonna play Spirit Shackles. If I can find like an Ice Manipulator with Spirit Shackles, that would be sweet. Or Artifact a little bit too limited, I feel. Darkness is nice as, as a kind of a trick. I'm gonna buy some food. Okay, so this is it. This was uh, chapter three. I'm gonna save the game now and um, join me again next week for chapter number four, where I'm finally gonna try to uh, to get up, where, where do I need to go anyway? Up north or something, or save a village? We'll just have to find that out when we uh, get to chapter, uh, chapter four. Before you go, please take a moment to like, uh, write a comment, share it on your socials. Do you like the gestures, by the way? Let's... Um, oh yeah, and you can also become a patron of the show via patreon.com slash timmytalk. So if you wanna support me as a content creator, Go check it out, and um, maybe then I'll see you in the uh, on the end scroll next week. Talking about that, let's go to the end scroll. What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? Her light in the morning. Way day and up she rises. Way day and up she rises. Way day and up she rises. Her light in the morning. Twenty minutes long, but until he's sober. Twenty minutes long, but until Somebody can see.